Unleash your words, understanding free verse in poetry. Hello, everyone, welcome to our channel where learning English is both fun and insightful. Today, we'll dive into the beautiful world of poetry. More specifically, we'll explore the concept of free verse. Whether you're an aspiring poet or simply a language enthusiast, understanding free verse will open up new horizons for your English language mastery. So, let's get started and unwrap the mystery together. Free verse is a type of poetry that throws traditional rules out the window. It's like a bird soaring through the sky without a care for lines or paths. In literary terms, free verse poetry does not follow a specific rhyme scheme or a strict meter, which is the rhythm pattern of syllables in lines of poetry. Instead, it relies on more natural rhythms, pauses, and stresses of spoken language. Think of it as the poetry of freedom, the poet's thoughts and emotions flow freely onto the page without the constraints of rhyme. Free verse is a relatively modern development in the history of poetry. It gained popularity in the late 19th and early 20th centuries as poets began to push boundaries and explore new forms of expression. Poets like Walt Whitman and Emily Dickinson in America, and T.S. Eliot and Ezra Pound in Europe are some of the pioneers of free verse who have greatly influenced what we understand by it today. Understanding the characteristics of free verse can be a bit tricky since it's defined by what it does not have rather than what it has. However, here are some features you might notice in a free verse poem. A regular meter or no meter at all. The poem flows without a set pattern of beats. Lack of rhyme scheme. Rhymes may occur, but they're not used in a regular pattern. Line breaks with no rules. The poet uses line breaks for emphasis or to give the reader a pause. Conversational language. Free verse often uses everyday language, making it sound more natural. Use of literary devices. Despite the lack of structure, Free verse can still make heavy use of metaphors, similes, and other poetic devices. Appreciating free verse poetry is all about tuning into the poet's voice and the flow of language. Pay attention to how the words and lines are arranged on the page, the pauses and breaths the poet invites, and the emotions that the poem evokes. It's more about the experience and the journey through the poem than about counting syllables or waiting for the next rhyme. Let's look at an example. Here's a snippet from a free verse poem. The fog comes, on little cat feet. It sits looking, over harbor and city, on silent haunches, and then moves on. Notice how the poet, Carl Sandburg, uses descriptive language and line breaks to create a vivid image and a certain rhythm, but he's not constrained by a regular meter or rhyme. And there you have it, folks. Free verse is a dynamic and liberating form of poetry that breaks free from traditional poetic constraints. It invites both poets and readers to experience the language in its most natural form, we hope this video has shed some light on the concept of free verse for you. Keep exploring, keep learning, and let your own words flow freely. Until next time, happy reading and writing!